Good day Aquarius and welcome to my channel. This is your St. Patty's Day reading. Uh, if you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, oh, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well and I hope this reading resonates with you. Universe Speak. Spirit's Guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Six of Diamonds. Ace of Spades. Seven of Hearts. <laughs> you get that one a lot, uh, Aquarius, quite often. And the Nine of Clubs. Okay, so your general energy for the uh, day is going to be the uh, Nine of Clubs. Um, yeah, you're going through a struggle, and the struggle is not over yet. Uh, you might feel like giving into the struggle and saying, screw it, whatever. But the cards say, don't give up. You're strong enough to make it through this struggle. And also, uh, just like um, burdens... Uh, a struggle sometimes is in your hands. Sometimes we have the ability to uh, get out of the struggle. So you might want to think about that uh, throughout the day. Uh, that you know the struggle might be up to you to finish to get to get it done. But the cards say either way it will end soon. Um, I just you know, especially coming up in the position of your energy, I would say that the struggle uh, might be in your hands. Uh, at the beginning of the uh, day, it looks like you're going to be misled. Somebody's going to mislead you and it's going to cause you confusion uh, about things that you know. Uh, so you might question yourself if you know what you're talking about. And the cards say, yeah, you know. You just need to recheck, recheck your footsteps, recheck your facts. Um, whatever it is that you're questioning yourself about. Uh, you know, you actually do know the truth about whatever it is. Uh, so just be careful. There's going to be people misleading you uh, in some form or fashion. Uh, but just remember that, yeah, you're fine. You just need to recheck your facts. Uh, in the middle of the day, well, fuck. It looks like you're going to have a chance to make a good investment uh, and, and live more like how you want to. You know, live a little bit more comfortable. Um so yeah, this is a, a, a finance uh, investment here that you can make. Now, make sure that you don't just jump on the first one that comes to you uh, just because it came up in the cards. Uh, because a lot of times we'll get, you know, sometimes we'll get multiple uh, chances to make investments in a day. And uh, you don't want to just jump on the first one that comes. You still want to go with your gut. And you still want to, you know, look at it mathematical and make sure that it is sound and it is something that will work out um, before you jump into it. But you do, you'll have a, a chance for a good investment uh, this day. Uh, sometime in the middle of the day, there's going to be a good investment that pops up. Um, also, I think with this good investment, I would be careful uh, with somebody misleading you and causing you confusion. Because uh, that could make you either take the wrong investment or that could make you miss out on the investment altogether just because somebody might not want you uh, to make the investment. Uh, at the end of the day, you need to stop. You're doing too damn much. You're either doing too damn much for others or you're doing too damn much um, for work or you're just doing too damn much and you need to cut that fat and rethink your priorities because your priorities are hurting. Your personal priorities are hurting. Uh, here at the end of the day and you need to focus on number one you need to focus on one uh, priority at a time finish that priority and then repeat uh, but right now you need to not be doing so much for other people you know people will be fine people will be fine uh, dealing for themselves for a little bit without you especially one day uh, people can chill for a minute and give you a break and give you some space and whatnot and let you, you know, enjoy yourself. Um, uh, so, yeah, uh, definitely cut that fat. You're just, you're doing too damn much and you're going to wear yourself out. So let's go ahead and see what the tarot cards have to say. Universe speak. 
And that could be the struggle. That could very well be the struggle as doing so much for other people. Uh, Spirit's Guide. What needs to be known. Oh. Right, went everywhere. What lessons need to be learned. Hmm. Got the Nine of Cups. So this man... He's very comfortable with what he already has, so you're probably very comfortable with what you have, uh, to some extent. But he could always get the ten. He could always get the tenth cup, and then his cup would be overfilled. You know, he would have ten cups instead of nine, so he'd have even more. So I mean, this is completely up to you. I feel like this is part of this investment, uh, but uh, I feel like there is something more waiting for you uh but that's up to you to take it you know you can either sit there and be happy with your nine cups or you can get your ass up and make a good investment and get yourself that 10 cup 10th cup so yeah that's what i'm seeing here for this card not 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 much of anything just it telling you that sure you may be comfortable but you could get that 10th cup you know um so yeah when it comes to a struggle it might be very well up to you it might be you taking on too damn much for other people and when it comes to being confused uh this day uh this may be caused by somebody confusing you and you need to just recheck your steps and your facts and you will see that you are a-okay so and yeah good investment just go with your gut go with you know math it out make sure it's all good and well and uh you know take it or leave it you can you know just keep your nine cups or you can take a tenth cup and get a little bit further in life uh so there you go really short reading aquarius um yeah i'm pretty sure i've said all that needs to be said so there you go i hope this resonates and i hope it helps in some way if it does hit that like button and if you would please comment share and subscribe i uh hope to see you back here next holiday and until then you enjoy your corned beef and hash your green beer or whatever it is you may be doing this day and um stay safe stay mindful and stay healthy